hello guys welcome back um today i am going to do a numerical on attenuation in optical fibers okay so question would be something like this uh, the attenuation in an optical fiber is given as 5 decibel per kilometer okay so uh, let's write it in math so alpha that is attenuation coefficient is given in decibel per kilometer so we have been given alpha that is 5 db per kilometer of length of optical fiber okay then it is asking that what would be the remaining intensity of light so remaining intensity uh, remaining remaining means somewhat which is which is left from the initial value so the remaining uh, intensity could be characterized by the power that we are eventually getting out from the optical fiber and with respect to power that was initially fed into the optical fiber so remaining power um, remaining intensity of light could be found out from this relation that is what was the power that was input and what is the power that we are getting out and the fraction would give us remaining intensity right because we are comparing the present status from the initial value so that would this would give you the remaining value out so we want to get out p out by p in one more information is there that the light has traveled 5 kilometers. So, travel distance of light or you can say the length of optical fiber is given as 5 kilometers. Okay. So these are the three things which we were given okay and uh, we are asked to find out the distance p out by p in so now uh, there are not many uh, formula that i have taught you so let's write whatever we know so we know that attenuation co uh, coefficient alpha is given as uh, alpha l by length first thing that we know is this okay how do i know that this would work because alpha l is given in decibels and length is given in kilometers okay so th this is one formula that we can use and the other thing is uh, what is the alpha alpha l loss that is the um, attenuation uh, in the optical fiber or the power loss so sometimes we call it power loss also so this is given as 10 log base 10 p in by p out remember this is p in by p out not p out by p in okay because in gain uh, you may find that it is p out by p in but in uh, loss it is p in by p out so this is the important point and you should remember it okay let's move ahead and uh, uh, so what, what are we given uh, we have been given alpha so this alpha is given okay this is this we have been given so this alpha is given as 5 and l is given as 5 right distance is given as 5 kilometer so this is l so actually we can find out alpha l alpha l is alpha into l so you can see it from here alpha l would be alpha into l so it would be 5 and this is db per kilometer and this is 5 kilometer so we have 5 db per kilometer into 5 kilometer so alpha l 
A is given as 25 dB. Okay, so we have found out this. But this is not asked from us. What what is asked this? P out by P in. Okay, so we are what we are going to do is we are going to write the formula of alpha L again. So alpha L, which is 25 dB, is also given as this thing. 10 log 10 p in by p out. Okay. So let me change the color. And okay. So we have reached up to this point. So now I have to find this thing, but I have to inverse it. Okay. So let's see what we can do. So we can send this 10 here. So we can actually write it. As 25 by 10 equals log base 10 p in by p out. Okay, and then what we can do is we can send this log here because it is base 10, so we can write it as 10 raised to power of whatever was in the left side equals p in by p out. Okay, so now we have p in by p out given as ten raised to power twenty five by ten. So p in by p out is equal to ten raised to power two point five. Now I can 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 do it. Uh, so I will use the help of Excel. You can do it on your calculator. So p in by p out is coming out to be. Okay, let's see. Let's see. So I have to find out 10 raised to power 2.5. So this is 316.2278. Okay. So this is 316.2278. But a question is asked of p out by p in. So I have to inverse it. One by C one six point two three. Okay, what is this? So let me use the Google uh, Excel again. So equals to one by this value. So this is point zero zero three one. Okay, so this is. Zero point zero zero three one. Okay, so this is my answer. So this is the intensity that remains. So this point zero zero three one. Okay, so this is our answer. Uh, thank you for watching.